Royal Rumble has kickstarted the road to WrestleMania and in a big way. I'm gonna discuss the ideal match card for WrestleMania 39 based on what happened at the Royal Rumble. Cody Rhodes won the Royal Rumble so he is facing Roman Reigns that's a no brainer. Who will Rhea Ripley face as she won her women's Royal Rumble match? Who will Rhea Ripley face? Well Rhea Ripley should actually face Bianca Belair. Two NXT stars main eventing a Wrestlemania possibly. That would be just wonderful to see. Asuka made her big return to WWE and she has embraced her evil character now. Asuka facing Charlotte Flair for the SmackDown Women's title actually makes the most sense. Why? because Asuka's undefeated streak was ended by Charlotte Flair and Charlotte Flair retained her SmackDown Women's title in 2018 at WrestleMania. So straight away story there, I hope WWE does this. Now coming to the second hottest faction of WWE that's the Judgment Day. Yes, they are the second best and you all know who is at number one, we will come to that at the end, who is the Judgment Day facing? Rhea Ripley is obviously facing Bianca Belair, no doubt. But Finn Balor is facing Edge. Finally, that feud needs to be done and dusted. I won't go into the depths of it, but they are saying it should be a Hell in a Cell match. I'm not a fan of that if it happens. But if it happens, obviously Hell in a Cell matches are meant to finish the feud off. So why not? Who is Dominic Mysterio facing? He is probably by far the most improved wrestler in WWE and he certainly needs to have his WrestleMania match. And who will he have his WrestleMania match against? It's his dad, Rey Mysterio. Straight, simple story. At the Royal Rumble, Rey Mysterio was supposed to enter at number 17. His music even hit. But did he enter? No, he didn't. But at number 18, Dominic Mysterio entered and he wore the Rey Mysterio mask. So what's the story here? Rey Mysterio was beaten up, his spot was given up and Dominic Mysterio was the one behind the scenes attacking Rey Mysterio, stealing his mask, coming out with it and basically entering the Royal Rumble. And this match should be a mask versus career match. Why? Because everything started with a mask. You know where I am going with this. If you have reached this far into the video, hit that like button. Now, right now, hit it. Just do it. A guy who deserves a WrestleMania spot is Seth freaking Rollins. Who will he face? Logan Paul is a natural heel and he eliminated Seth Rollins from nowhere. So. That's a feud that's set up at Royal Rumble and it's gonna be a banger of a match. The Lesnar vs Lashley feud is something that I just can't wait for these two to square up in the ring. It's an ongoing feud and it must culminate at WrestleMania. And Lashley's dream would come true. You got to feel so good for Lashley. He wanted to face Brock Lesnar. Another banger? would be from the banger man himself Sheamus and who does he face? I am thinking Gunther vs Sheamus vs Drew McIntyre for the IC title. Sounds good right? It does sound good. Imagine the triple threat, imagine the physical beating. I mean if this match happens, man this is gonna be a banger if it happens and what does Sheamus give us? Banger after banger after banger. After there is one guy who is coming out every week and is saying the champ is here. The champ is here! And there was a certain guy who we can't see used to say the champ is here. The champ is here! And I'm indeed talking about John Cena vs Austin Theory for the United States title or as a normal match. Title doesn't matter here, but 
John Cena is definitely returning at WrestleMania 39 if the rumors are to be believed. If Austin Theory wins, what a win it would be for Austin Theory. Let's talk about the main event of the Royal Rumble. You all know what happened. I am not even gonna go into the depths of it. It was mind blowing. It was pure cinema. Now what should happen? Let's get this straight. Sami Zayn is facing Roman Reigns at Elimination Chamber which is happening in his hometown of Montreal. Jey Uso walked out at the Royal Rumble confused, conflicted that Sami Zayn hit Roman Reigns. So what happens now? Jey Uso comes and costs Sami Zayn the match, turns on Sami Zayn but out comes Montreal's another own Kevin Owens. He helps Sami Zayn. The bloodline obviously stay on top. But Sami Zayn and Kevin Owens hug it out. Next week on Raw, they will announce that Sami Zayn and Kevin Owens will go for the undisputed WWE Tag Team titles. Man, April should come already. After January, straight away April should come in my opinion. Anyways, like this video, share it, subscribe to the channel and I will see you guys in the next one.